Hey, what up Long Beach? Welcome back to the 562.org. It's Mike and this basketball video is brought to you by Naples Rib Company, the perfect place to cater your team's next event. Strike up the band, Milliken hosting Long Beach Poly, a battle of two of the top teams in the Moore League. As we all know, the Jackrabbits have been wearing the crown in this league for a little while. Milliken wants to take that off their hands. Jackrabbits defense, the biggest story of the game, in my opinion. They certainly controlled things early for Polly. Justin Renee sneaks away, gets the ball to go, and one. On the other side, it's Miles Carmen on the drive for the Rams. He did a good job of getting into the lane, getting some easy points to keep them in it early. Jordan Williams with the happy birthday three ball. And then Solomon Jones, his brother Ben, and Jeremiah Atkinson all checking in for Polly today. They are eligible after the sit-out period expired a couple weeks ago. Nice to have six foot eight on your side. Not a lot of uh, real post players left in the Moore League as we've been talking about all year, but Jones, the sophomore, certainly fills that role. And then it's defense to offense just that quickly for the Jackrabbits. That's been their style for, I don't know, 40 or 50 years. <laughs> Why switch it up now? That's Atkinson from deep. Polly in control, but never pulled all the way away in this game. The junior, Tyler Thornton, taking it to the rim for Milliken. Every time Polly threatened to turn that lead from 10 to 15 or 20 points, Milliken got a basket. The Jackrabbits, though, on the other end, got what they wanted on offense. They got into the lane and they hit big shots. Jonathan Green, a big game for Milliken. Two huge three-pointers at the end of the first half. But look at the feet work. Malik Salahuddin with the nifty moves on the up and under. And then Renee with the buzzer beater at the end of the first half. That is going to give the Jackrabbits a 39-27 lead going into the locker room. And when Polly is hitting from deep, they're really tough to stop on offense because they can also drive by you. Certainly the same is true of Rob Diaz, the freshman. A very nice game for the Rams. Williams with the answer back. Seemed like every time Milliken hit a three, the Jackrabbits would answer with one. And then look at the sophomore connection. Peyton Watson finding Solomon Jones. Polly fans have got another two and a half years of that connection. Renee waiting outside for this one. He had a game high 19 points, but as I mentioned, the Rams would not go away. Stephon Leonard here. They were down by about 10 most of the night, but they never let it get away from them. So credit to the Rams for that. Offense to defense again. Renee, the baby bunnies. Salahuddin. Every time Milliken threatened to get close, Polly also hit a big shot. So it was sort of a stalemate here between 10 and 15 points for most of this game. The freshman finding the senior, Diaz, to Leonard in the corner. And then quick hands for Green on the cookies. Salahuddin with the rip and the score. He had 14 points. His defense definitely changed this game out on the perimeter. Polly takes a 70-55 to win. Jack Rabbit's still in first place in the Moore League. The closest anyone's come to him so far has been nine points. Find out what happens the rest of the way. You got to keep it right here.